When was the last time you hit the pause button to listen to your inner voice? I can remember a pivotal time of ignoring my emotions. I was destination bound on a monorail to appease everyone else in my life and ignoring everything about my desires, dreams, goals, and on a path to just graduate college. And then I could start my life. It allowed me to stay future bound, ignore my inner world, and quite frankly, stay distracted from the emotions and feelings that I was actually experiencing. And it was a wake up call because after I graduated college, I had the opportunity to take a pause and listen to my inner voice voices. And what I discovered was there was a lot that I was ignoring, that I was suppressing, that I was repressing. And it was scary because all of a sudden I, be, I became face to face with how disconnected I was from myself, how confused I was about who I was, what I wanted. I saw and felt finally how negative my worldview was, my self-esteem was. And it wasn't until I gave myself that opportunity to pause life to slow down, to f take that opportunity to listen. To fearlessly face the fear and negativity that was causing so much inner turmoil and confusion and bottlenecking of even feeling like I had passion. So where are you not giving yourself the opportunity to push the pause button? to listen to the inner voice, to the thoughts, to the emotions that are bouncing around in your inner world that are not getting any attention right now because you're so focused on getting somewhere else in the future. This is an invitation to do that, to have the courage, the bravery, the passion, the purpose, the opportunity to love yourself, to love your imperfections, to slow down and feel all the complexities that you might not understand. To discover yourself. <laughs>